hello everyone it's Kritik here from IT Rebels and today in this video we'll be learning about how to style a CSS link we have created a folder test.styling and some HTML and CSS files I have created a simple boilerplate and an empty CSS file in this boilerplate I have linked our style to our HTML and created a link here too let's view this in our browser and it's look like this a simple link so how to style a link you can just target and uh, anchor tag directly using this and a direct element target CSS property then give a color col or color and you can give any color to it like I can give an aqua and then there is very famous uh, property which we give to an anchor tag like text decoration text text decoration and none so to remove that underline we have used text decoration then if you want to make something like uh, make your link look like this button look like a button then you can just give it if some padding or background color b a c k background color then zero 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 it is a color code for black and view this so it's then give some padding to it p a d d i n g padding padding 10 pixel 10 pixel pixel from top and bottom and five pixel from left and right save it okay 30 pixel 20 pixel from left and right it will oh yes now it's looking good and whenever we click on this it will lead us to our website servicesstrategy.com then you can change a link property uh, like whenever someone hover over it you can use h o v e r hover and change that color to white and color to little bit of black control s like this so to know more let's see more about link styling so we can style uh, our links uh, as per uh, visited hover or active so whenever if we have visited this link it will it can be of different color like uh, if we have visited this link I want it to be like uh, a dot visited V I visited then I want it to be already read okay so we have already visited it so that's why it's getting the visited link and when it's active like when we click over click on it it will can, it can be on different color not hover when we click ACTIV ACTIV active color can be of red so hover will be white and click will be red so we can customize our link like this and there are te uh, text decoration properties like text decoration learn to uh, give uh, if you don't want any styling to for our text then on hover it can be underline or 
active it can be a fund aligned so with this you can design any anchor any link to a button and if you want to give a icon to it you can just give something like if you want an icon to be displayed here then hero hero i see an icon icon Boom, control S. Style is equals to H E I G H T height uh, height twelve sixteen pixel W I D T H width sixteen pixel. pixel. So I think this will work. you can just add your icons here also but this is not the right way to add an icon uh, we have taught you in a previous session that how can you add an icon to an element if you don't know watch this similarly you can uh, style a button element too like uh, instead of anchor you can just create a button element b u t t o and b u t t o and button okay button text t a x t text then class c l s class is equals to b t n Okay, let's see this. As you can see, uh, we have a button element. A default by default, a button element look like this, and we can just change button to A to dot B T N. As you can see we can style our button element similarly as links so with this we have completed our CSS style properties of a link and buttons so if you like this video please like it and if you want to be a web developer and a blockchain developer uh, we highly recommend to subscribe our channel for more videos thank you